Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So earlier this month, as I posted, Microsoft rolled out PowerTwiz version 0.93, which is the latest release. And this was quite a big update because it included the new major dashboard redesign. It had a better command palette and a whole lot more going on. And I'll leave the video linked if you'd like some more information. Now, something that the current stable release version 0.93 doesn't have is a search bar. And if you want to find a module or a tool, you have to scroll down this list, which albeit is a lot better since version 93's update. Or you have to go through the different categories to find your relevant module or utility or tool. Now this could all be set to change in our next version upgrade to version 0 0.94. Because according to a pull request over on GitHub, it seems that the next version will offer an upgrade with a dedicated search bar. So if we head over to GitHub, yeah, we can see setting search and this is just a demonstration. It is in a foreign language, but it will give you the general idea. So it's going to be here at the top of the page. Very similar to what we get currently in the settings in Windows 11 at the top of the page. And according to the pull request, this will introduce infrastructure, Microsoft says, and code to support search functionality with PowerToy settings, including a new search index specification, a dedicated search library, and updates to the solution configuration. The main changes, Microsoft says, are the addition of a spec describing how settings should be indexed and navigated. So I think this will be a nice move in the right direction because most settings apps and PowerToys has got a lot of settings, as you may well know, have a search function and search functionality. So I think having some sort of search in the app will definitely introduce a lot more functionality and user friendliness into the app. And when that does roll out, obviously I'll try and keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.